Even though this is the story mode, there are other modes. You can free mode, just do a stage, do whichever. Adventure mode lets you do individual challenges to unlock new things, including uh, characters, I think. There's like hundreds of those, aren't there? Oh, yeah. <laughs> this is a vast yes. roster. We won't be doing that. You can play the game for yourself. You want to see that? Uh -huh, here's how I changed their costume. Link of the Wild. Yeah, yeah there we go. go. He's the blue boy. While I play as Impa, anyway. <laughs> well, he'll be in the background, and I'll point him out. Yeah, Jake could be like, I play that. I play the game. Impa wasn't in it. Go fucking back. <laughs> no, actually, according to Brenna, he won't even have it in costumes. I mean, cutscenes. No, they're pre-rendered. Ah, I, I hate it when games do that. It's such a pet peeve. Although the battle had been lost, Impa foresaw Link's importance to the coming war. She bestowed upon him a green tunic, the sign of the legendary hero. Link I kind of like that detail because Impa tends to be the guide in a lot of the games. So in this, even though she's an active combatant, she recognizes that Link's going to be the hero, so she instigates that by giving him the tunic. Soldiers were holding out against the monsters in Farron Woods. Passive aggressively, of course. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> gives him the tunic. He <laughs> gives him the tunic and severs a bridge that he was going to try to cross. To oh, oh, I'm so sorry. I need to <laughs> solve a temple first, shithead. Can you jump that far? I can. Try. Yeah, try to jump the chasm. I rock. Okay. <laughs> Look at this. My sword is bigger than you, than your entire being. Warrior. Warrior. Warriors. Warrior lawyer. I'd watch that movie. The Phoenix Wright Warriors. <laughs> I would watch the hell out of it. Oh, look at the stall children. They're so gangly and goofy. Ah, uh, they're, oh, they're fucking stupid. This, I love it. This is not a fair fight at all, actually. <laughs> ba-bam, ba-bam, ba-bam. <laughs> oh, hey, the stall folks have the same sword design from Ocarina of Time. Yep. And body design. Nice. I mean, I'm not surprised that they're referencing everything ever, but still. Blue, could you stop itching on the mic stand, causing it to shake? For reference, Blue is his cat. No, Blue is my dog. Blue is his dog. For reference, <laughs> uh, Yoshi doesn't know what the fuck he's talking about. <laughs> Martin is our cat. I, I assume that, I don't know why I mixed the names up. <laughs> Well, we, we just got blue. He came down from Ohio. Where'd you go? Back to Ohio. There. What, oh, there you are. Every time I don't know where he is, he's always just to my left. I should start looking there first. I found a captain oh, behind a gate, and I can't help him. Yar. <laughs> Open the gate, just cut it. Well, I could do a flip over it, but nah. Yar, har, har. I think it's really cool that she just, like, puts the sword between, like, her feet and just swings with that way. Like fucking Raiden. Yeah. Like, it's, it's so anime, but it's so awesome. I don't know if Sheik would be my uh, fucking... I don't know if Impa would be my character. Because, like, it seems like all of her attacks are, like, right in front of her rather than, like, side to side, like Link's kind of was. Doesn't seem like my kind of play style. I think I need to go around. They made the sword large by putting a lot of metal into it. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, Link, you're just chilling. 
Thanks, Proxy, I'm stupid. Well, maybe I am stupid, I just wasted my special. <laughs> <laughs> Alright! Uh, interesting approach. How about you blow it up? Ooh, we got to use that now. special out of rage towards Proxy. Oh, look, it looks like a fucking Final Fantasy character. Splash. I like that they decided that Impa's just water elemental. I know what those things are called. It's a whiz robe. It's called a whiz it's robe. It's a Poe. But it's a wizard in a robe. It's a ghost. <laughs> Your heart was in the right place, Jacob. Yeah, but my, the rest of me wasn't. <laughs> Your heart was in the right place. To a Zelda geek, that means nothing. Yeah. Whiz Rogue is in this game. I assume that just everything Zelda related is in this game. Like, just I, feel, about. I feel like it'd be... I feel like it'd be easier to list the number of Zelda things that aren't in this game. Characters, fucking locations, enemies. <laughs> Reinforcements are here. <laughs> <laughs> Any character in Breath of the Wild? Oh, yeah, none of the. They could have they could have added the champions as DLC. It would have been like specifically in this game, they would have been tight as fuck. Like with all their powers and stuff, like fucking Urbosa's lightning, Rivali's wind, uh, fucking Darunia's fucking I'm a ball. <laughs> I mean I'm Darunia ball. would just be Darunia again. <laughs> you know, just without a hammer. And Mifa would be like, I'm cute, and everyone just dies. Also, I, I believe you mean Daruk? Daruk, Daruk yeah. <laughs> they look like almost the same. And, and they're fucking, they're both Gorons with beards, with names that start with a Daru. It's understandable. Except shit, I got something wrong from the game I played. <laughs> Damn it. Well, if anything, Jacob, I mean, if Roy and Ike have to be in Fire Emblem Warriors 2, then they can put the champions in Hyrule Warriors 2. Exactly. Nintendo... Nintendo's the one company I wish they did more DLC. You know? Well, they're starting to figure it out. Starting to, yeah. <laughs> Although, it's weird. Like, with Nintendo, I always think they're, like... They're ahead of the game, but then they're also somehow backwards at the same time. Yeah. They're the like... valley of the game. <laughs> they're the parabola of the game. Like, they'll come up with something so incredible, you're like, that's genius! And then when you see them try to do online or something, that it's like, oh, cool, it's 1986. Nice. Great job. But, like, the, the biggest example is like, all right, over the course of, like, three years, we're going to add more characters to Mario Tennis Aces, all right? Uh, what's Mario Party? Ah, hey, you got four boards, that's enough. <laughs> it's good. It is, so dude, Super Mario Party's great. Four, four, four boards, that's... Listen, if listen. you pretend there are four extra boards, it's the same thing, says Nintendo. Listen, Super Mario Party is a great game. It is so good. But it's so ripe for DLC that it doesn't have. It's so... It's, I feel, I really feel, I would pay $20 for like two more boards. I'd be an idiot, but I'd do it. Nintendo's listening. Hmm, he's an idiot. Hmm, he will willingly give us his money. Nah. 
Sometimes I feel like they're like that. They're like, we could easily make money by capitalizing on something people actually want, or we could not. I don't know, guys. I feel like motion controls are finally going to catch on. <laughs> All right, they're backing away from it a little bit. I'm just waiting for them to just make, like, the Smash Brothers, but for Mario Kart. Since oh, my already, God. Since they already had Animal Crossing and Zelda characters be playable, and then, like, do the biggest disgrace to Captain Falcon ever and use his music and tracks, but they don't fucking make him playable. I know. Oh, there's a me costume. Uh, there's a me costume where they put his fucking ride in the game, but you can't play as Captain Falcon. I do, I do kind of wish Mario Kart would turn into like Mario Kart and friends because that's basically what it is already, but just go all out with it. I mean, there's fucking Link, Isabelle, Villager, Inkling. Yeah, that's Platoon, right. They were in the Switch version. Yeah, and then like have all these tracks based on like all their Nintendo games. It would be so good. I mean, not that I would like if Mario Kart 9 is just another Mario Kart, then I ain't going to complain, but... <laughs> I mean, uh, yeah, I'm not going to complain, but if, if hell, they could even keep the Mario Kart title as long as they just let all the other characters get in. Yeah, Mario Kart and friends or something. Yeah. Because yeah. I would absolutely main the hell out of Fox McCloud and Arwing. Yeah. It'll have to be okay. grounded, of course, but still, it, it could work. But then there's Star Fox Grand Prix, which is, I mean... Is it is it still a thing that could it, be a thing? It seems like Star Fox Grand Prix might have actually just been somebody misunderstanding the Starlink DLC because there's like the racing aspect to it. Yeah, they might race would be cool. They, they probably saw that and they were like, "Oh, this is a Star Fox racing game." Oops. <laughs> Wish Run away from that guy. <laughs> Oh fuck that wall! Oh, you get you gave it to him good. Yeah, but like uh, the little graphic made it seem like in an anime, like you totally actually slashed it. It just didn't register. And in a second, it'll just slice in like perfect half. <laughs> oh, and Richard, since you're asking, uh, we we started again. We started streaming like a. A while ago, but uh, we restarted it to catch up because uh, we were having latency issues. Link's like, oh no, more like 30 more of the enemies that I've already killed 250 of. This cutscene doesn't make any sense. <laughs> Hang on, Sheik's got to be real cool real quick. Oh my god, that long hair. Damn. The princess isn't dead, but the queen has arrived. <laughs> yeah, bitch. I actually prefer Impa's playstyle to Sheik, but Sheik is my favorite Zelda character, period, so I'm a little, I'm a little divided here. Well, she came in with the power of rock. I know it's a harp, but still, she's that good. Middle the wheel on the on the harp. Yeah. <laughs> those are cords, those are my it. friends. <laughs> Die! Oh shit! No, <laughs> oh, they're 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 cute. I remember when I was watching a friend of mine play Ocarina of Time when I was a kid. And I always just called them hedgehogs. They kind of look like hedgehogs on it in the N sixty four version. I'll give you the benefit of the doubt and assume that you probably thought that because of the rolling thing. Yeah, because they're because of the rolling thing, the, the shit on their back kind of looks like spines. If you if you're if like a kid. Yeah, but that's actually not a bad assumption. Rock hedgehogs. Oh, yeah, and there are combos. I think when I did my first impression stream, this was also the level where I realized, oh, there are combos. Not just press X 15 times. Yeah, was, Actually, uh, X is the power of one. It's the one I haven't been pressing. Uh. <laughs> I'm pretty sure it's like this for every Warriors game where every character is just like a move list. Oh, 
I want a legit Zelda game where you play as Zelda. Well, Jacob, if we go back in time to the Philips CDI, that's uh, I, I want a you real said legit. Zelda game. <laughs> yeah, uh, that's that's why I specified legit. <laughs> but honest to God, you have no idea how bad I want those games. <laughs> Yeah, you are the only person on Earth who's ever universally said, oh boy, a Philips CDI, I believe. <laughs> yeah, because my my local GameStop, GameStop, Game Shop, like not GameStop, no, it's just a local game store, had one in stock. I think it got sold. I haven't seen it in a while, unless it got moved to a different store or something. Um, and I was like, God, I kind of want it, <laughs> but it's $300 and it sucks and probably doesn't work very well. Can you imagine if you spend five hundred dollars on that box and then you try it and it just it just bursts into flames? But here's the, they had a few games um, with it. One of them was Space Ace, so they got one of the like three good CDI games. What is Space Ace coming out on Switch? Dragon's Lair is already there. Not that I'm like a hardcore Space Ace fan or anything. It was a bomb in disguise. Uh, well, that's horrible. I'm never shopping there again. <laughs> what about Game Go or Game Slow? I'm a fan of Game Drift myself. I don't know what Game Slow is. GameStop's competitor. Oh. Oh, wow. I, that flight went right over my head. Sorry, Jacob. When you get that Philips CDI, though. Game Freeze! And not the... And not the Jason DVD U. <laughs> <laughs> Christ! <laughs> the Jason DVD <laughs> Oh. Dude, that was, the, that was the working title for the Switch. And <laughs> Reggie was like, no more used. Also, no more DVDs. We could keep the Jason part, though, right? Yeah. <laughs> the, the, <laughs> what if? What, <laughs> fuck, what fucking if the Switch was called the Nintendo Jason? <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, I present to you the Nintendo Jason. Everything's the same, except it's called Jason and it's sold a quarter of what it actually sells. <laughs> According to sales analysts, uh, Nintendo has lost their goddamn mind. <laughs> Comes with a free hockey mask. Oh, now that'll get people buying. And then you can also use your Nintendo Jason as a hockey fuck. Because no third party developers want to make for it. <laughs> it's actually a ploy to encourage kids to exercise by using their expensive toy as real, like, sports equipment. Let me tell you, it's the sturdiest thing Nintendo's ever made, and that's saying something. Console is shaped like a hockey mask. That'd just be scary. Like the eyes glow red when you turn it on. Actually, never mind. That'd be cool. Nintendo, get on it. I mean, your face might melt off because of the heat, but hey, you'll be good. Nintendo, well, Nintendo's finally trying VR. <laughs> the it's Nintendo, terrifying. The Nintendo Jason VR. Oh, she can do meteors. Why? Why not? She's awesome. Because <laughs> it's Dynasty Warriors, Jacob. Anything goes in Dynasty Warriors. Drat. Is Nintendo Labo VR any good? I heard it's cool. It very not not like full fleshed out, but I heard it's neat. Uh, Sheik's doing the straight up Naruto run. Oh, if there was anyone who's allowed to do that. It, it yeah. should be the ninja character. Should be re renamed the Sheik Run. Blech. Mission start? 
It has. It didn't start before. <laughs> no, it just says that every time there's like a new objective. Okay, I was just like, well, you've, I'm pretty sure you've been playing this mission for about a good ten minutes. Nah, Shinx has been having a workout routine. I, I don't think I didn't see you try to attack the 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 fucking knights there. Look, when there's 70 billion models on screen. And I can't lock on to any of them. And this game looks fun. I'd probably enjoy this. Yeah, I think you probably would. You should probably just play it as soon as we're done. As soon as I wish. Or, you know, when you have, like, time off or whatever. Yeah, yeah. I, I got it on Wii U. The undefinitive version. Yeah. One where you can't play is Breath of the Wild Zelda. A.K.A. a 6 out of 10 game. Any game where you can't play as Breath of the Wild Zelda starts at a 6 out of 10. And everything that that's about as good as you can get. Everything just downhill from there. So oh, that includes Breath of the Wild itself. Yes, Breath of the Wild. Five out of ten. Smash Brothers, fucking three. Because <laughs> they had the opportunity, but they didn't fucking do it. That, you know what? I'm so petty. I named my Zelda amiibo Researcher. I really thought you were going to say I named my Zelda amiibo Better Zelda. <laughs> no. Like, oh, she's a researcher. She can't fight. Maybe I can get some of my friends to do something useful. Link, we'll I need you to get donuts. You got it. Impa, I need you to, well, you know, just, just keep being you. I need you to Impa. <laughs> she folds her arms. Perfect. I need you to go imp some paws. Throws imps from doom at uh, my dad. <laughs> thanks, say thanks, Impa. <laughs> I really thought you were gonna say thank you and good night. Thanks for coming. <laughs> uh, we call that Jacob stand up. Oh yeah. That's what you can come to expect if I ever do stand up. I just flew in from Florida and boy Still here <laughs> There is no follow up I just flew in from Florida and boy was I born here The other day, went to a store and I thought, been here before. <laughs> one day I went over, went, I drove down to one of the houses I lived at as a child, got arrested. One guy in the audience. Thank you. Thank you. You see, you, you, you can relate. I don't know, I listened to The Old Apartment by Bare Naked Ladies and I just thought that was a good idea. God, that, that reference alone should get me booed off this. A Bare Naked Ladies reference. For like their <laughs> beat, for one of their B tier fucking hits. It's not like their big hits that everybody know, that everybody knows. It's not one of their like underrated gems that nobody knows except fans of the band. It's it's just like, oh yeah, that was a hit for like a, a week. Nothing's wrong with bare naked ladies. I love bare naked ladies, but to a general audience, it's like, uh, wow, good joke.
Why don't you guys stop me? <laughs> well, because we need to know where you're going first, and we never do. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'll say this about you, Jacob. Like your your comedic style is literally unlike anyone else I know. <laughs> it's a combination of a lot of shit. Most like a good half of it's from you guys. Um, and a lot of shit. Yeah. <laughs> It's like a, it's like fucking Ed Ed and Eddie mixed with you guys mixed with delicious cinnamon back when they were a thing, but mixed with like Game Grumps, mixed with fucking just whatever I feel like. Opinions on vaporwave. What do you think we're doing right now? <laughs> this is this is this is fucking. Hyrule Warriors to put on to jams while you fucking study. Whatever those videos are. <laughs> Lo-fi straw hat no streams is what you're yeah. trying to tell me. Yeah. I remember when like Game Grumps would name all of their stream VODs that and it was impossible to find like a specific stream. Uh, Brenna is asking E3 predictions? Um, new Smash DLC. A lot of Animal Crossing. Um, I don't give a shit what anyone else is doing. Because no one seems to be doing anything. E EA's not going to be there. PlayStation's not going to be there. Is Microsoft going to be there? I think they are. I think? Um, it, second week of June, I think, it's going to be. My predictions are, uh, most likely from Nintendo, we're going to get stuff we already knew about. Mostly. Uh, I imagine maybe like two, three new brand new reveals, but I imagine Smash DLC. Uh, maybe they'll show off a little bit of Metroid Prime 4, maybe Bayonetta 3. Those uh, last two are big maybes. Uh, Animal Crossing for sure, because people cried loud enough about it. Uh... Maybe a little more Mario Maker 2, which, by the way, looks fucking incredible. Oh, yeah, it looks phenomenal. I, I imagine they'll talk about it for a little bit, since I know they're having a Mario Maker 2 Invitational. It comes out a couple weeks after E3, so... Yeah. As well. And it's for sale right now. Yeah, I would, I would like that, too, with anything. <laughs> Have a good dinner, John. Mario Maker at Evo. Oh my god, the multiplayer looks so much fun. I was thinking the same thing when they were like competitive co-op modes. It's like, oh, oh man, Mario Maker at Evo. The competitive mode, it's such a good idea. I never thought about it for even a moment, but I want it so bad. I imagine they learned after what um, co-op New Super Mario Bros. Look, look, looks like. It looks like people fighting. But they're doing it online. That's just not something Nintendo does with games like this. It's just like, you know, couch co-op. Can we do it online? <laughs> no. Are you looking forward to Rune Factory 5? I'm very looking forward to it. And the rem remaster. Even though I LP'd for damn near completely, I'm still going to do it. Oh, yeah. Where well, you got to be. Um... Going back to the E3 things, I don't really have E3 predictions, but more like E3 hopes. Uh, aside from, like, Smash DLC. Uh, look, in my heart, I'm always gonna want a new Punch-Out. And a new Star Fox. Whether or not I'll actually ever get those things is, uh, to be determined by puppies. But, um... <laughs> But pretty much for the most part, it's just like hopeful games. The, the other, other thing, which I think it's possible, and I really hope so, because it would make Let's Playing a little easier, but also because it's the 30th anniversary, a Mother Trilogy would be really cool on Switch. And other than that, um, pretty much all I, all I ask for. Just give me Punch Out, Star Fox, and uh, Mother, and I'll be good. Uh, 
Ah, yes, yeah, Pikmin 4. I almost forgot about that. Pikmin 4 would be cool, too. If they got farther than, like, a napkin drawing. Even when I'm completely failing to do the objective that I need to do, I'm having fun. <laughs> yeah, it's kind of how it is for Warriors games, even if, like, it's like, Oh my god, you're losing your square! It's like, it's the second you get there, you'll see that your teammates are just sitting there, and they're not really in pain or in danger. And it's not hard to reclaim it. Oh, well, that's kind of that kind of sucks. Well, seeing as how they don't seem to be taking any damage, they should be all right. So you would think Wizro would be a reference to Wizrobe, but he looks more like the Pose. <laughs> I guess they couldn't call it Poro or Posero or Poser. <laughs> oh, it's Poser. Uh, just ignore that guy. God, that water bubble was on his face for a while. It's a good thing he was, like, he's already dead, because if he was, like, a person, he'd just be drowning there. Impa, jeesh. Pretty good way to stun lock him. <laughs> I might have to look up speedruns for this. To see how fast they clear everything. I'd like to see a, a tool assisted speedrun for this. That's oh, probably boy. insane. they got escorted they kind of just went there on their own there wasn't a lot in their way <laughs> there wasn't anything left uh, it's advanced <laughs> it's th <laughs> I think the bomb she was like hang on I need my prompt <laughs> I need to know you believe in me I don't. That causes me to explode. <laughs> and this is the Impa Merry Go Round. Oh. She is just <laughs> in the middle of combat. Probably make sure that Link is actually going to the exit. Oh, well, where is he, anyways? I have no idea.
There he is. He's taking his precious time. And he's not Breath of the Wild version. Why the hell? <laughs> Maybe when you were selecting the costume, there was like a confirm option or something. Maybe. Or he just felt like changing because it was too hot. Therefore, we put on a scarf that's flammable? Impa did a laugh and a pose. Is there a taunt button I don't know about? I think she might have been uh, relishing in the murder of 3,000 enemies. Alright, I'm back. Oi. So, Thorn, apologies in advance, because... Like, while I was, I was, in fact, uh, muted on Discord, my recording was not muted while some friends of mine and me had a conversation for that time. So I'm very sorry for, your, for editing Thorn. You know it's not the first time. Yeah. I hope it was, a, it was a very riveting conversation that you can splice in somehow. No. Plus there's people and I... I agree, Jacob. Sorry, I was letting Blue... <laughs> I was letting Blue out of his cage. Got a lot of stuff. It just take all. Did you just, just take everything? Everything. I need to pick. I need to pick Link at the character start screen. Okay. Well, he's it. It auto starts at him here, so we'll get to see it then. Hey, the training dojo is in case you get a new character and they're pretty far behind everyone else. Hey, oh yeah, each each character levels up on their own, don't they? Yep. Yeah, you just have to whack enough people. That's me, the people whacker. Also known as the Mafia. <laughs> we whack people over here. Like, after all those magic items you just got, like a cool spear and a scepter of time, it's like, yeah, here you go, here's a wooden sword. If. <laughs> the Majora's Mask Mirror Shield, that's awesome. Yeah. Ah! Let's boost Sheik a bit here, too. Sheik actually needs a combo. That isn't just a meteor. That being said, uh, having a meteor as your base normal attack, that's, pr that's a pretty good start. Impa needs a lot of big Poe necklaces. Not sure how common those are going to be. And she's level 8. Whereas Sheik is level 6. But Link is level 4. I think we need to boost him a bit. <laughs> well, I mean, the second you had access to Impa in Zelda, it was like, well, putting him aside... <laughs> I don't think anybody would blame you, though. Yeah, if I if I wanted to play as Link, I would play any other Zelda game. I assume you have to play as who they tell you to play as in the story mode. Yeah, you can only choose characters. who's. Yeah. Okay. So you can't just hop into the next realm and play as Minna. Realm level. <laughs> Not until the plot says you can play mid. Jacob's Audacity is still recording, though. Huh? Jacob's Audacity is still recording, though. Wieners. But. 
anus. Malcolm's gonna have to edit that out of the audacity. Would you quit? <laughs> I legit you, don't do that. You were on, you were unmuted. I mean, you were muted. I know, but. He's still gonna have to hear that. Oh God, we, he's never heard meaner and butt before. Poor no. Thorn. He hasn't. Well, now he's gonna hear this argument. Fuck. Yeah. Well. Thank you for the support, Link. Don't blame.